Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you're using Mozilla Firefox, just to let you know that Mozilla has updated the layout and the design of the extension listings on its add-ons store. Now, if we just have a look at a archive version of the uBlock origin listing on the Firefox add-on store, this is what it used to look like. This is a Wayback Machine archive around about the 15th of July this year. So this is what we had before the update to the design and the layout. And now if we head into the add-ons currently, this is the new layout. So you can see things looking a little bit different. Now, first of all, it shows all the information the older design used to show and display. There's just a couple of differences when it comes to the visual representation. Mozilla hasn't changed the way the add-ons icon name and developer name are displayed. So that remains the same as previously. And yeah, we can see that the recommended and the available on Firefox for Android badges have been moved below the add-ons name. And you'll also get two new elements in the header. A star rating plus number of user reviews and the total number of users as you can see and then just below that we now get the screenshots of the add-on directly below the header and then below that we get about this extension and nothing much has changed here it looks basically the same as it used to so if we head back to the archive version we can see about this extension looking very similar and then below that, we've got the different ratings by the reviewers. Yeah, we have other popular extensions, permissions and data, more information, and then the release notes giving us the different fixes and changes. And then yeah, we have more extensions by the developer of the said extension. Now, if we head back to the previous version, the archived version, we can see that everything's a lot more condensed on the page. They are making use of a lot of free space. So it's taking less scrolling down the page to see all the information provided. Whereas in the new version, if we just pop up there quickly to the top, we can see that because all the different sections are covering the full page, not filling up different segments of the page, so therefore now you've got to scroll a lot longer to see all the information where previously that was not the case. But with all that said and done, when it comes to the layout, I think it is a lot less confusing. For me personally, this looks quite cluttered. This just looks more visually appealing, although you've got a couple of extra bits of scrolling to do to see all the relevant information. But nonetheless, just keeping you guys posted if you are using Firefox, which I know some of you are. So what do you think of the new add-on store layout? Do you like the new one or prefer the old one? Give me your thoughts down below. I'd be interested to hear. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.